السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته يقول الله سبحانه وتعالى وأطيعوا الله ورسوله ولا تنازعوا فتفشلوا وتذهب ريحكم واصبروا إن الله مع الصابرين Obey Allah and the Messenger and do not dispute and then you will fail and your power will go away and patiently persevere for indeed Allah is with those who patiently persevere here Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala reminds us of a very important principle. And it's not simply about unity, but it's about unifying on the basis of what Allah and His Messenger teach. That is the standard based on which we unify. The verse was revealed in the context of the battle of Uhud. In that battle, the companions disputed with the Messenger sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, and he ordered the archers to protect the backs of Muslims on the mountain of Uhud so that they would not be attacked from above. But what happened is when it looked like the battle was a victory, they came down and they disobeyed the messenger sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, except a few of them. Then the enemy army was able to turn around and attack them from above. And the victory was turned into a defeat and 70 companions were killed. And it is with great difficulty that the Muslims were able to repel them, but they had lost 70 of their own. It's very important for us to understand that the guidance of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is not simply a nice to have. It is the path to success. With it, we can be successful in every endeavor of our lives. Because either we will accomplish what we set out to do, or we will meet Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala in the process of accomplishing what we set out to do. And therefore, we will be among the successful. But if we do not do this, then we will go in different directions. Everybody has their own mind. Everybody has what they want. Then what will happen is that we will fail and our, our power will go away. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala tells us, hukum. Literally, it means that your wind will go away. And if you imagine that when the wind is all going in the same direction, it is so powerful, it is irresistible, it can destroy a town. What happens is when the Muslims are going in the same direction, they are very powerful and they can be successful. So let us always return to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and obey Him. Let us always return to the teachings of the Messenger sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. Then He tells us, and patiently persevere, because Allah is with those who patiently persevere. Inevitably, we will hit difficulties in the path. And if you stand up for something that is meaningful, there will inevitably be difficulties. But if you patiently persevere, then Allah is with, will be with you and then you'll be successful. What better time than the month of Ramadan to exercise the chance to, be, to patiently persevere, to exercise patience, so that throughout the year we are among those who stay the path. May Allah accept from me and from you our fasting and may Allah make us among those who are successful. Wassalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.